Name? Bond. James Bond. So you're not dead? Hello, Q. I've missed you. The world's moved on, Commander Bond. You were double O. Two years. So stay in your lane. You get in my way. I will put a bullet in your knee. Lashana, um, joining this franchise as a double O, there hasn't been many others outside of James Bond. Does that add an extra little touch of history and pressure about the role? Oh, a touch of history. It's all of the history. Yeah, I think this is amazing that she was she was written and she was written so well and she's a double O and she's fierce and all of the things that come with her I think is incredible. They've done exactly the right thing for the franchise right now and I feel really honoured to play her alongside... You guys. It was brilliant having you. Thank you. I'm so glad. See? Ben, it's your third time round as Q, and we get to see Q's house this time, as we've seen in the trailer. Um, what else can we you tease about what fans can expect about the development of Q? Uh, well... <laughs> I suppose... It's the continuation of uh, the relationship that Q has with Bond that's been growing over the previous two films. Um, that's the thing that I really love and in this one find quite touching. But I don't want to give too much away. Yeah. Um, and I haven't seen the film myself, so I am open to being surprised by what it is we've made as well. Great. Um, Lashana, was there a moment during filming where you're like, I'm on a Bond set, I'm, I'm like in a Bond film? Yes. I want to say when we were like two weeks into a night shoot for like a Oof. shootout of some sort, you see it in the trailer. Um, there's a moment when I just slide and just shoot at a baddie. Um, yeah, that was, uh, when it was like 2 a.m., 3 a.m., 4, I thought, wow, this is, this is really what it takes to be here. These people work hard, mm. continuously, getting everything right, every department's on their A-game, serving the moment. It really felt like every moment was creating cinema history, and I think that's what keeps this franchise alive, actually. With the delays, has it been hard to keep the secrets, or because, the shine you've been in Marvel, Ben, you've done this a couple of times already, are you just locked boxes right now? You're not going to spoil anything for anyone? I'm actually really good at keeping secrets, like even from my friends. A lot of my friends find out things in the press or they'll watch the film. So you're now. a great spy. Really. I'm a great, I'm actually a spy <laughs> right now. <laughs> FYI. <laughs> yeah, I, I really enjoy it. Cause I like my, my people to enjoy it in the cinema and not yeah. have any tips from me, you know, so. Yeah, absolutely. You? Um, I find that I can't re remember very much <laughs> about the film because two years have passed since we made it. <laughs> yeah. And I can't fun. remember what I did last week let alone two years ago. So yeah. it's not been very difficult to keep it a secret. <laughs> yeah. And even though obviously this is Daniel Craig's final Bond film, we've seen other Bond actors continue with new Bonds. Um, have you two thought about potentially returning to the franchise or your futures? Could you see yourself in another Bond film? It's so hard to say, isn't it? Yeah, when you literally don't know. We have no that. idea and yeah. we wouldn't want to assume anything. No. <laughs> and We'll be back next week. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or jinx anything, or I don't know, <laughs> yeah. and it's, um, oh, we're here to celebrate this one. Yeah, I think it's nice to be present and just celebrate what's happening right now, and it's been such a long time coming that yeah. it would be hard, it would be a real shame to just pass this by and think of the future. Um, <laughs> yeah. You know, so, um, yeah, I think that this film deserves us to just be in the moment. So that's what I'm, I'm going to do. Yeah, me too. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just do that. Let's agree on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Finally, now it's finally coming up. Um, what are you excited for Bond fans to see uh, when it finally comes out in cinemas? I just really... What I think's thrilling is that it's... This film is a brilliant conclusion or a brilliant wrapping up of the four previous films. Yes. And there are so many strands from previous films that are sort of completed by this one yeah. and i think that will be very satisfying for for fans of the franchise yes that's true also i think um they thought really long and hard about 
everything being an ode to the old fil the older yeah. films, an ode to classic That's cinema, really true. an ode to cinema in general, that um, you kind of, it's like a feast for your eyes. You kind of get a few genres in one, which really keeps you on your toes. And it's very exciting to watch and to play. Um, I think they're going to get a lot from it. I, I, there might be a lot of <gasps> gaspy moments. Um, yeah, they're going to love it. Yeah.